This question is, do you think three days on, one day off is the way to go? And I don't know if they're referring to as an affiliate or as a... Uh, uh, an athlete, and I think in both cases, not necessarily. Three days on one day off is a great, great way of training. Three days of working out allows for pretty high intensity each one of those days, and then a little bit of rest. Problem is, people's schedules don't always align with that, and um, people athletically can sometimes handle more than that in a row, and sometimes need less than that. I think it's more important that you accommodate people's schedules, because when they can get in the gym is probably the best time for them to be in the gym. Uh, that's why we've always programmed for seven days a week as an affiliate. As an individual, it's uh, important to pay attention to your body and figure out what works best for you. I've seen a really common pattern of three days on, one day off, two days on, one day off for higher level athletes to handle high volume. That allows for a good amount of rest and a good amount of volume in each one of the days that you're actually working out. Um, that is, once again, you're paying attention to recovery, paying attention to your, your metrics, like is everything going the right direction? How is sleep? How is stress? How is eating? Um, and those things should always be comfortably taken along in the right direction. But for normal people, for affiliates, I think you getting in the gym, when you can get in the gym, according to the schedule that you have, is probably the best bet.